Anything more you need, Frank? No. Oh, coffee. Frank, you know I already cleaned that out by now. And when you quit with that, you're going to burn the place down. I'm leaving this here for you, OK? I swear that girl's got it out for me. You're not the only one. Anything else you need, ma'am? Ma'am? Is there anything else you need, Maria? Just wanna know how you are, baby. Alive and breathing. Yeah, thanks to me. Yeah, and look at how far that got me. Ava! Brad! How are you, kiddo? Good. Do you have that speech ready for graduation yet? Oh, not yet. I can't wait to hear it. The whole crowd's gonna be there, Ellen and the kids too. Aww. They miss you. They say the new babysitter can't play Pictionary quite like you. <laughs> oh God, is there anything I can get you? Uh, coffee, please. To go, actually, night shift. Oh, and I wanna give you this. You should have. <laughs> ah, thank you. Thank you so much. Happy birthday, Ava. <laughs> All right, well, take a seat. I'll get your coffee out. <laughs> Can we talk? Maybe later. I've got a person. It'll be two seconds. How's school, honey? Good. Great. Well, I'm putting up a show next month. Maybe you could stop by. I'll pass. It'll be good for you. You can meet people. Eddie Martinez will be there. You like his work, right? No, I like Ferris. Well, it'll be fun. Maria, I don't think Quit that with that! With what? Maria this, Maria that! Well, not every mom deserves to be called one. You know, sometimes I wonder where you get your mouth from. I learned from the best. I just wanted to give you a better life. Better life? Do you know how many times I burned myself in the stove because you refused to cook for me? You only want a better life for yourself. It's not like you wanted me there. Like it mattered what I wanted. I was trying my best, Ava. Are you stupid? It's not like I had a good example to follow either. It only takes common sense. And look, you turned out just fine. Just fine? Not fine enough for dad? Your father. You have no That's... right to say anything about my dad. I could've gotten into Weston if you had just been there. Ava, you don't have to be just like him. I haven't seen you in what feels like an eternity. That's exactly my point. But that's the past. Forget the past. Of course that's what you want to do. Forget. That's what you're best at anyways. Oh, gosh darn it, Ava. I don't know what you want me to do. Anger does nothing but hold you back. You're my only child, and you don't even give me enough respect to call me mom. Hey, how long are you going to make me wait? Well, you better be glad I even paid you. Yo, you better pay my daughter. Daughter? She sure doesn't think so. Well, nobody asked you for your opinion. Frank! Here you go, sir. Keep the change. Your mother used to be really good at this, you know. Used to be the best waitress down at Melrose. That's actually where I met your father. How is he? Your father. How would I know? I mean, is he working or are you oh, guys? Oh, he's definitely working still, just like you're working still, just like everyone is still working, just like I am still working. Working is good for you. That's how you build skill. How do you think I became the amazing artist that I am? I remember you used to dream of that. 
being a great artist, just like me. Would you expect that to still exist, Maria? I had to grow up. You definitely did, with my attitude, too. You remember. How could I forget? It's, uh, it's nice. I didn't want you to see it after the one you got from. Oh, Brad? <laughs> yeah, he's amazing. He always kept me out of trouble, him and Ellen. You should meet him, actually. Yeah? You know I can't replace you, right? Trust me, I've, I've tried. Ava, I want to be there to give you advice at every milestone. Roby scene four, shot one, take three. Action. For this project, four Penn students, me, Xiao Xiao, Yu Liu, and La India, and four Kappa students, uh, Sarah, Olivia, Avani, and Brooklyn, made a narrative short film. I feel like it was a challenge. Like Mr. Cloughlin would say, like, these are Penn students, they don't know any much about film and they want to try to do it. And I was like, that might be different for like younger students to help older students learn more about film. Because when you guys came in, I was like, oh, so I guess it's like going to be a documentary. And then we saw the video from the other school, and I was like, so is it about us? I guess we just had to be different. But then I was really happy that we chose a narrative. Our original idea was like, we kept it very simple. We were like, hands. okay, we got hands, <laughs> we got like two shots, we got one area set. And then somewhere along the line, we just went, we're doing an entire diner scene. <laughs> we were just like, oh. Cool, and <laughs> how are we gonna do that? I remember at the beginning when we uh, first time we went to Kappa, uh, we got to know each other by several times of chatting, talking about their school lives, their families, and their habits, and what they want to do in the future. And we sit down and brainstorm about what kind of story we are gonna write in our film. I don't know, I, I mean, I really liked this experience. It was very stressful at times. Like when we were first coming up with the ideas and when everything was like changing every five seconds, I know all of us were just like, whoa. Our big break came when we figured out, oh, we can use improv. 
Um, and so we had myself as Maria and Avani as Eva sit down and do a scene. Is there anything else you need, Maria? No, how are you, baby? <laughs> I'm like, ah! <laughs> um, again. <laughs> We recorded what they said, that became the script, and once we had that, we could start rehearsal. We had a space, we filmed in the cafeteria, and so it went from brainstorming, scripting, brainstorming, improving, scripting, to the actual filming. This story is about mother-daughter relationship. Um, so mother is kind of absent while the daughter is growing up. Um, so there's tension, conflicts between them. And our film, our story is about how they two come to understand each other. It's my first filmmaking project. So everything is challenging, but I feel excited. This was fun and challenging. I do think this gave me experience that I will carry on for hopefully years to come. <laughs> this was a very good experience and it helped me a lot in the art world as much as just personally too. Um, my takeaway from this um, project is um, collaboration is important. Whew. It helped me understand a lot that I didn't understand before. But it was still like overall fun and I think the outcome was like, it was nice. I feel better and be more comfortable to share my own thoughts and opinions with our teammates. That's really good. <laughs> I do think that this enriched my life. No questions. <laughs> go big or go home. Cut. <laughs> a chunk went up. <laughs> it was a chunk of something that went up the straw.